After clapping pirate cheeks and hourglass for weeks, I took a day off to go spermunking in caves to rest my weary body and spirit. After hours of some hardcore cave exploration, I found some neon glowing, extremely not sketchy cave mushrooms to snack on. I immediately knew I'd fucked up. The colors were insane, my ears were ringing, I passed out only to be awakened by a voice. Lord, Lord Sweat, Sweat, can you, you hear, hear me? me? What? Who's there? Show yourself. I'm the Invisible Island Spirit. You've opened a doorway to a happy new dimension. Why am I wearing this stupid skirt? This is a happy place. Aren't we all happier when the wind blows through our coconut fields? This is ridiculous. I'm a killing machine, the king of pirate slayers. I don't have time for this happy skirt bullshit. Oh, you're no killing machine. You're a sweet boy. It just needs more guidance. Annoyed by the island spirit, I headed out of the cave, but the mushrooms were intensifying, and I started tumbling down the rabbit hole. The whole island turned into Willy Wonka's chocolate factory. We are the island worms for nature's candy treats. And because I was higher than a top hat on a giraffe, I started eating everything. I was like a crazed zombie with an unquenchable appetite. Chickens! Chickens! I know where the Sour Patch worms. Let me show you! I couldn't snap out of it. The mushrooms had my head in a vice grip, and as I stumbled back towards the ship, I heard the sound of voices singing sea shanties. Drunken sailor, what do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor? They're on the boat with three magical singing piglets, and they spoke to me in their cute little Charlotte's Web language. Come on with us, Lord Sweat. We're your new crewmates. I'm Hank. I'm Dusty. And they call me Sugar Tits. Porky Pig and the boys started up their next verse, and all I could think about was my bed. As I faded to black, I thought to myself, maybe this vacation was a bad idea. Take it away, Sugar Tits. Now, once was a ship that put to sea, and the name of the ship was the Billy